Yeah, I'm excited. Uh, I get to yeah. do that again. Kind of. I'd like to call this meeting to order. Will the secretary please call the roll? Ms. Cancro. Here. Mrs. Chu. Mr. Hong. Here. Mrs. Lax. Here. Mrs. Reese. Here. Mr. Sealer. Here. Mrs. Shaw. Here. Mr. Simmons. And Mrs. Becker. Here. We have a quorum. Please rise to salute the flag. <clears throat> I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. The New Jersey Open Public Meetings Law was enacted to ensure the right of the public to have advance notice of and to attend meetings. In accordance with the provisions of the act, we have caused notice of this meeting to be published. The Board of Education Office, written notice was also provided to the Sentinel, the Newark Star-Ledger, the Home News and Tribune, and the Municipal Clerk of East Brunswick. All Board of Education meetings, with the exception of executive session discussions, are videotaped for later broadcast. It is the policy of the Board of Education that videotape meetings are not edited for any purpose, so individuals who speak at the Board's public meetings should be aware of these videotaping rules. Good evening, everyone, to the first meeting of the new school year. Um, even though I don't have children in our school district anymore, I still feel that September is the beginning of the year, and it's a time of renewal. And um, I hope that everyone, uh, all parents, teachers, staff, oh, and the kids, had a great, great opening to school. And I have a feeling we're about to hear in some detail about that opening. Oh, no. Oh, okay. Oh, yes, yes. So we're skipping yeah, we'll, the superintendent's <laughs> report today. Yes, we'll, we'll, we'll give you that information. Dr. Valeski, take it away. Thank you, Ms. Becker. Um, good evening, everyone. Staff members returned on September 1st to prepare for the school opening and to receive important guidance from administrators. We'd like to thank all of our staff for the time and effort they put into preparing our schools and classrooms for opening day. On Wednesday, September 6th, the new school year began for our approximately 8,150 students. Teaching and learning was evident from the moment the first bell rang in all 11 of our Blue Ribbon schools. I'm happy to report the new school year is off to a great start. Back to school nights for parents started on Monday, September 11th. This important annual gathering is designed to give parents an overview of the school program. Attending back to school night is a great way to stay connected to your school community and establish communication with your child's teacher throughout the year. While at back to school night, please visit the PTA membership table. Become a member of your school's PTA and show support for all the PTA does to enhance our students' educational experience and promote a positive school climate. You can also show your support for the East Brunswick Education Foundation. Members will be offering apples for education at all back to school nights for a small donation. All proceeds will be used to fund grants which enhance and enrich teaching and learning for our students. Stop by the EBEF table and learn how you can support the foundation during this school year. I am proud to announce that 18 students have been selected as semifinalists in the 2018 National Merit Scholarship Competition. These students are among 1.6 million juniors across 22,000 high schools who took the 2016 preliminary SAT National Merit Scholarship Qualifying Test, which serves as the initial screening for program entrance. We invite you to visit us on Saturday, September 23rd at our East Brunswick Public Schools table at the fourth annual East Brunswick Day from 12 noon to 5 p.m. The event, sponsored by the East Brunswick Township Recreation Department, will take place at the East Brunswick Community Arts Center located at 721 Cranberry Road. I look forward to seeing you there. Look for the Superintendent's Prize Patrol if you see me wandering the grounds. <laughs> I might have a surprise for you, including board members. The East Brunswick Celebrity Dance-Off is a charity event supporting the East Brunswick Education Foundation. 
Dancers raise money through votes, sponsorships, and advertising. Please join me for this wonderful dance competition benefiting the EVEF on Sunday, October 15th at 7 p.m. at the Joanne Magistro Performing Arts Center at Hammershoal Middle School. And that also includes two members of this organization. Just a reminder, schools will be closed September 21st and 22nd for fall recess. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Bileski.